Hello and welcome. This is the Greenbar Valley Church of the Nazarene with your daily devotion for Monday, December the 27th. Today we are reading from the book of Matthew, chapter 5, verses 1 through 12, the Sermon on the Mount. Here is the word of the Lord. Now when Jesus saw the crowds, he went up on a mountainside and sat down. His disciples came to him, and he began to teach them. He said, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they will be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they will inherit the earth. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they will be filled. Blessed are the merciful, for they will be shown mercy. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they will see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. Blessed are those who, who are persecuted because of righteousness, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are you when people insult you, persecute you, and falsely say all kinds of evil against you because of me. Rejoice and be glad, because great is your reward in heaven. For in the same way they persecuted the prophets who were before you. And that is the word of the Lord. <clears throat> Our article today is titled, Blessed. And it is written by Stephanie Hendrickson, who is the editor of Reflecting God, the publication from which our daily devotions come from. Here's what Stephanie writes. Our world is infatuated with winners. We are drawn to the brightest and the best. We want to be included in the popular crowd. We desire to be with the crowd on top. I've seen this played out on the local Little League baseball fields. Kids of all ages and sizes gather to play baseball. While many are there to play, others are encouraged to excel with extra practices, more coaching, better equipment. Precision focus is aimed at being the best. Sometimes the love of the game is misplaced in the race to be the best. Jesus' famous sermon isn't a list of winners, movers, and shakers. Rather, Jesus speaks to the poor in spirit, mourners, the meek, those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, the merciful, the pure in heart, peacemakers, and the persecuted. What if our relationship with Christ wasn't about being the best, but being the most pliable in God's hands? Perhaps we need to embrace the kingdom of God and all who are called to be, rather than striving to be successful. Where do you identify yourself in Jesus' sermon? Embrace your place. The hymn is, Christ is made the sure foundation, Christ the head and cornerstone. And that is, Christ is made to sure foundation, a traditional Latin hymn. And from Psalm 15, verses 1 and 2, Lord, who may dwell in your sacred tent? Who may live on your holy mountain? The one whose walk is blameless, who does what is righteous, who speaks the truth from their heart. And that is your daily devotion for Monday December the 27th. Have a blessed day.